Hello, my friends. This is Brian, the speaker for the dead, coming to you today from the truck as I'm sitting here waiting to get unloaded. I was thinking about something that's been on my mind for a while. The Lord of the Rings, the Rings of Power, the Rings of Wokeness, the Rings of Whammon, whatever you want to call it. Now, full disclosure, I have not watched a single minute of this show other than the trailers that I've seen or the bits and pieces that people have used in their uh, reviews of it. And I keep thinking the same thing about this show. Why? Not why was it created. We all know why it was created. It was created for diversity and inclusion and to completely alter something that is traditional and value-based to use it to corrupt those very values of good versus evil, right and wrong, truth and lies. Um, you know, because that's what, that's what evil people and evil in general does is it corrupts. It corrupts good things to try and make them bad, which is actually at the very heart of the story of Lord of the Rings. Uh, Sauron... Uh, and before him, Morgoth corrupts the things around him. He corrupts the beautiful things that have been made by the other creators and twists them to evil and darkness. Um, so, I mean, it, it's in the story itself. You know, it, the, it, it's, it's an amazing thing that they, that Amazon took the very concept and showed it in real time what evil people do. Good job, Jeff Bezos. You've proved yourself. You're right there with Morgoth and uh, Sauron. Because he corrupts things too. They corrupt things. So does this little chap that most of us who are Christian refer to as Satan. Not good company to be in. Not good company, Jeff. Um, anyway, I I'm confused by the people who are watching this show and then reviewing it. Now, I'm not crapping on any of those channels. I understand the whole idea of content. You need to create content. This is something that's going on. It's a cultural event. And so you want to comment on it and you want to make content using it as a stepping stone or as a sounding board. But I don't understand the hate watching. The like what see I'm I'm one of those weird people that if I'm eating something and it tastes bad I spit it out. I don't keep eating it and go, mmm, yep, this spice tastes as bad as a lot. Let me try that again. Hmm. Well, this one's worse than the I mean, that's that's what I feel like a lot of YouTubers are doing. They know this is bad. They know it's not gonna get better. Um, things that start out bad very rarely ever get better. Um, without divine intervention or or some coming to Jesus moment, for lack of a better term. But I don't understand why people continue to watch this over and over every week just so they can crap on it. Um, I, I, I kind of like the way the Critical Drinker has done it. He's done a review and basically said, it sucks. Here are the reasons. It's all bad. Done. Um, I think he's probably on some other people's live streams talking about it and stuff like that. But I mean, for his own channel, it seems like he did one review and then just was like, okay, this is, this is the problem. This is what's wrong. Boom. I'm done. This is trash. It's garbage. Don't watch it. If you want to watch something in this similar vein, go watch house of the dragon, which apparently is better. Who would have thought that, you know, um, before this all came out, we knew rings of power was going to be crap, but we figured that the house of dragon would be too i haven't seen that one yet um but now that they've totally and completely destroyed the witcher series uh season one was pretty good season two was just an absolute shit show um and and that was one where it wasn't so awful that you it was unwatchable but it was just it was not good either it was one of those things where you kind of you're eating it and you're just like mm, well, somebody's up to see it. <sighs> And you spit out the little thing that was bad. The mouthful is actually pretty. I know. It's not a perfect analogy, right? I'm sorry. 
I'm a, I'm a, I'm a truck driver. I'm not a, a, a you know, a, an English lit major. Um, but anyway, so I just, just stop, stop reviewing this guys. Stop giving it airtime. Stop giving it views and clicks. And, and, and I mean, even if it is to just crap on it, just let it go, let it go, let it die. Kill it if you have to. <laughs> anyway, thanks guys. We'll talk to you next time. Bye now.